everybody, this is Juliana. Um, I'm here to share with you guys this little jewelry box that I've made for the Piece by Piece Etsy store. And it's this little jewelry box that I had purchased from a thrift store. And actually, I didn't purchase it. They were completely free. They had a bunch of these um, jewelry boxes outside in this box. And I got a couple of them. Some of them are in pink, and then the other ones are like this gray color color and I think the reason they had them for free is because some of the little pieces inside the jewelry box and like the cameo was uh, broken so I have a pink one that is kind of semi broken that I have to fix but this one was actually still in really good shape so I was able to save this one and I wanted to go ahead and alter it using the Prima Fairy Rhyme um, collection and also some um, what do you call them? embellishments and laces from the piece by piece Etsy store. So this is what it looks like as you saw it on the pictures. Um, what I did to alter it is I used the Prima paper of course that goes all the way around. I kind of distressed the edges to make it look more shabby looking. And then um, I covered the front as well, which is just a little drawer that I'll show you guys in just a second. But um, I added the paper and of course I had to use some of these new trims from the piece by piece. They're absolutely stunning along with this one as well. And then um, this is part of the trim that I think it was the, the top part of it. So I just kind of cut it out a little bit. And then use this beautiful like floral uh, trim also from the piece by piece in like a grayish color. So this kind of creates a little column there. So I added some of them around and then um, added the paper and the trim on the other side as well. So this is pretty much what it looks like from the front and then this is the top. So there's more of the Prima uh, Fairy Rhyme paper here on the background along with tons of trims from the piece by piece that are so beautiful you guys. So I stay with the cream colors, just a little bit of like a tan brown color there. Um, this is one of those acrylic hearts from the piece by piece very beautiful it's like a vintage pink color very pretty and i used some of the trim as well and i kind of created like a little flower kind of like behind the, the the heart there to put it in the center um these little crystal sprays are also from the piece by piece um she has a tons of different colors on these so i just added some of the clear ones just very gorgeous added a little bit of cheesecloth underneath the the heart there Okay, sorry you guys, um, my battery on my camera died. So um, anyways, so I was just saying here, I created a little flower. I'm using some of the trims from the piece by piece. And I used this little heart bling. Heart bling also from her um, Etsy store. And I just added a little piece of trim on the middle there. So that's pretty much the front here of the box. That's what it looks like. And now I'm gonna go ahead and zoom in so I can share with you guys what it looks like on the inside. So this little lid here goes up. And um, what I did here is I just added some of the Prima Paper Collection on the background as well. It actually had like a little mirror, but I took it off and I just added the paper and some of this beautiful uh, trim that she also carries and this one right here as well. It's very, very gorgeous. And um, on the inside, I added more of the Prima paper, like on the bottom there. And um, it's just holding a few embellishments from the piece by piece that um, Bev has available in her store. So, you know, she has like the little birds and some of these little heart, gorgeous little blings, um, flat back pearls, and some of these cute little owls as well. So that's what the inside looks like. And then it also has this little tiny drawer that pulls out. So I just added some more embellishments um, on the inside as well. Just a really, really cute um, jewelry box. And um, I had so much fun altering it with the piece by piece trims and embellishments. And I hope that you guys like it. I will have more pictures available on my blog. And you can also check there all of the trims um, that I use and the embellishments I use for this um 
Yuri box. So if you have any questions, feel free and let me know, you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I hope everybody has a wonderful Easter. Um, enjoy the sun and have a wonderful Easter, everybody. I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye-bye.